What's going on you guys? My name is Coco Crystal. You can call me Crygo. Welcome back to my literal nightmare and fear. We're here getting ready to fight the third gym. Literally only the third gym. We're like, what, three weeks in now? Not even. If you guys don't know, I actually have Corona's gym up on my side screen because that's how scared I am right now. I have to, I have changed the team we have, you can see on the layout, we have a Vile Plume now. Leafy has evolved. Oh, it's a double battle. Fuck. Okay, does Hariyama get anything crazy? I don't think so. Okay, I think Hariyama gets like thick fat. We're gonna double into Hariyama because Hariyama's the scary one. And we're over leveled. That is my fear. I don't care. I taught, I bought, I've got pulled at all stops. I know I was saying I'm never gonna use the trainer listing while I'm battling, but in the end, I really would rather win. So, trainer listing, because I need to know. Oh, bro. And I overleveled because her team is literally insane unless you have answers for it. She has a Breloom with normal gem and technician for fake out. We have a Halucha with Rocky Helmet, a Metacam, which is literally a, my greatest fear right now, that has power up punch. everything is power up punch except for her infernate by the way so that's like basically why i'm scared her, the three pokemon i'm most scared for are medicam halucha and infernate the breloom i'm not too scared for because i can actually try to survive a hit and then sludge bomb it and i should be able to kill it everything else like medicam halucha and infernate i think my halucha for halucha i need to use in moltres for medicam it is a rock gem, and Metacam is the one I'm really stumped on how to deal with. Same thing with Infernape a little bit, but the difference is Infernape has all its punches, so I might use Infernape to go against Infernape. That's what I'm thinking. I don't know. It has Quick Claw. That's the problem. Heracross. I can deal with Heracross. It's just really scary. This this battle scares me a lot, and also because we don't know what Pokemon's going to be coming out next. On top of that, causes a lot of issues. So I'm really trying to win this. I don't want to lose. I I realized hell with having double typings on my team. We're gonna do it, and it might be the best decision. I'm pretty sure my vile plume still has effect spore, so if I have to sack it, we will be okay. So I'll just give you the quick recap on what vile plume, my vile plume has really quick. Vexpor still with a special attack reducing nature. Fuck. With uh, Sweet Scent, Sludge Bomb, Giga Drain, and Stun Spore. And the idea is to try to keep her, use her for the ability to speed control a bit more. Make sure like Infernape isn't able to do something crazy. If And that's the concerning thing about her team is because of its, they all have power up punch. Except for Infernape, which is Iron Fist. It's gonna be an issue because they're gonna be strong. I literally just lost my Pangoro and it makes me mad to see this. I was looking back at my team and everything and I was in my PC and I realized how mad I am that I lost my Spear Tomb. Because Spear Tomb would have helped so much in this match because the fear of other Pokemon is gone. Like, doesn't exist. I, if I had, if I had my spirit tomb, spirit tomb, my voice cracks. If I had my spirit tomb, Medicam would be literally zero threat whatsoever. Psycho kick, cut, psycho cut can't touch me. High jump kick can't touch me. Rock side can touch me, and power up punch. That's it. That's it. I think I'm gonna switch into. I think my I, my plan is gonna be when I face Medicam is switch into my. Mall trace, and then switch back into my. Oh, it's got pure power. Switch back into my Tangrowth or something to eat it. Even though it's got Rock Jump pure power, which is gonna suck. And then heal up and hope it dies. Like that's that's what I'm thinking. I'm gonna go heal now because the fear of God has been put inside me, and this is gonna this is just gonna suck. I don't want to lose. We're so close to everything good. And I think part of this is because of the randomizer. With the randomizer, the way this thing la has laid me out with Pokemon, I have nothing for these Pokemon. I'm gonna lead in with 
my bile plume, and we'll try to deal with that. I could put poison jab on my infernape and deal with her infernape like that. She doesn't have healing items. Maybe that's a good idea. Maybe it's a good idea. Infernape doesn't have poison jab. Everything else he has is resisted except for mouth punch and stuff. Let's see. I might get rid of punishment because punishment just doesn't seem like it's a logical move to have. I'll get rid of punishment. We're gonna run poison jab. I'm so scared. Our team is literally four levels above her ace. By that halucha scares me. The the halucha scares me. The infernape scares me. The medicam scares me. Like the the maker, the game maker for this game took no chill. He was just like, we're gonna make sure these players regret everything, which is bad. If I had anything was steadfast, I'd be happy. But I don't. Normal gem, technician, fake out. That sucks. It's gonna really suck. I'm gonna heal and assume I can eat a few of her hits. Future! Future Lady of Kells, ready for action! <clears throat> I'm so scared. <laughs> Guys, I'm so scared. I'm so used to looking at my field of view for my camera, which is like right here. But you're right there. I know it doesn't really matter to you, because I'm pointing straight at you. Ha! I'm just messing around with you! You know you're rolling in the aisles, right? I didn't know you were a strong trainer, so let's get the show on the road! Ready? <laughs> I don't think we're getting into Mega Evolution this episode, because I'm going to be so focused. Okay, there's her brother. I knew she had it. I'm going to click Sludge Bomb, just in case. Does Effect Sword trigger on other, bug on other grass types? There's the normal gem. This one shot's gonna be mad. Oh, it does absolutely nothing. Okay, so far good. Maybe because we're overleveled, but we're faster too. Please kill. Okay, Rolim's down. One answer. I wanna say she's sending Medicam next. I wanna say she's sending Medicam next. This is when, when punishment would actually be useful or knockoff. Anastasia could get through none of them actually. If I can hit a mud slide, a mud, a muddy water, it will cause her to have a lower accuracy on Medicam. That's what I'm hoping. I'm hoping I also predicted right. I predicted very wrong, and this is gonna hurt a lot. I'm going to Dragon Breath because it's stab, and that's gonna really hurt. Please do a decent amount. Please paralyze. It did 123 minus, minus 65 is what? I don't know. 123 minus 65. I need, to, I need a calculator. I don't have my phone near me. I threw it on my bed last episode and I haven't picked it up since because we've been bulk recording. Uh, 123 minus 65 is... It did 58. If it gets a high roll, we die. We die. Gonna try again. Okay, come on, man. Ah! Oh my god. Oh my god. Dead. Haluta's gone. That's one threat. Done. I'm still terrified for this Infernape. But... T okay, fine. Why do you want Tickle? Absolutely not. Okay. What do we send in next? I'm assuming it's gonna be like Infernape or something. Infernape is the answer for everything! I'm gonna set in KFC to be safe and hope. If I can get this polygraph to set up rain right away, Infernape's gonna have some trouble. There's Infernape. Pressure, it is Quick Claw. I'm gonna wing attack and hope this thing doesn't murder me really quickly. Oh my God, there's no way, we're faster. I know this looks like I've over leveled to beat him, but it's purely because her team is a literal nightmare of gods. She's got planned out. I'm so scared of this Medicam because it has Rock Gem, Pure Power, Rock Slide, which is gonna suck. I'm so glad I dealt with the Inferno though. That was one of my threats, major threats. Medicam is the other major threat. There it is, there it is. Okay, it's gonna use Psycho Cut, which is gonna probably kill me because it's Pure Power. 
Um, vine, I'm hoping, will eat it, but it probably won't. I don't have any water left or drink left. Come on. There's a psycho cut. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. I don't like that. I don't like that. Um, Sun Swore. High jump kick. That's gonna hurt like a bitch. Oh, bro. Get paralyzed. If I can get a few par paralysis to come through, I'll be happy. It's pure power with a plus one boost. We are taking a lot of damage. That's all I'm saying. If I can, if I can stall out until I, she gets a paralyzed, I can hit it with Giga Drain or something. Start you, making her use her her other thing, her other healing, her healing items. Okay, 84. I want to say I can live another one, but it's always up to debate. I have to do this because I'm not losing Pokemon right now. See, like, leveling, over leveling wasn't a bad decision. Okay, did 70. I can live one more. I'm faster. How am I faster than a Medicam? Dude, give me that HP back. That's good. That's really good for us. Uh, I would say Ancient Power, but it's going to be resisted. Okay, she's not using... I think she's saving them for some of her other Pokemon. Dude, our threats are gone. She's been playing bad. She's only got Polyrath and Kakario left. And if she's smart, she'll send in... She won't send in Polyrath. And you know what's a funny thing? Lucario doesn't actually have any rock type moves. So KFC kind of just runs out, runs house on Lucario. I think I probably one shot. I can probably one shot Polyrath as well. Hello, my friend. Ready for a stab flamethrower to your face? This should probably kill. Burn? Oh, dude. Why is this so much easier than I thought it would be? It's because you played bad. <laughs> And I'm a little high level. I'm literally four levels-ish above. Now I know, I know, I'm higher level, blah, 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 whatever. I don't care. I needed to win this. It's not a boring fight because we've had a bit of trouble. Yes, I know it gets boring if we don't kill, if we don't lose Pokemon. Dude, we're about to get a Mega. I'm not giving up that encounter. I'm not losing Pokemon and losing this lock right before we get a Mega because that would suck. And I'm sweating because my room got really hot. Oh my God, $6,000, I'm down. Oh, I finally defeated a lock. A lion in the corner has a terrible display. You're rhyming? You're not an ink, you're not Ram Ram Ramsey, Ramos. This is it, I must give you my, uh, my title. Admit your, to your strength far exceeds. Just teasing, but here's your badge, boy. You'll be rolling them soon. Thanks, man. I've done it. We beat another gym. Okay, I'm mean, gonna try not to overlevel all the time, but this was one of those times I was so scared. If you have the rubble badge, then you can trade Pokemon to level 50 with your friends and they'll be ready to roll. They'll love all these W, all right? And you'll be able to roll over waves to the HM Surf even outside of battle. And here you won't. Why won't you take this ATM? Oh, it's Power Punch, right? Yes, I'm giving it to my Infernape. That's a good move. Gives you a plus one attack every time you use it. So let's get our Mega Ring. Absolutely. I'm not reading the rest of you because I don't care that much, Corona, to be honest. Let's get going. That was honestly a little bit of fear doing that match because Corona is a nightmare in this game. She literally looks like a lock ender, a lock killer, but the randomizer and lock, we were able to actually do it. Halucha scared me a lot. I'm surprised. I could have easily died to Halucha. Very easily. And who would have thought that Leafy would actually be an important part of the winning of this game? Or the, of that match. So now we have to just go up and fight our girl. What's her face? Corona again. But we, I think we only do the one-on-one. -on -one, which is good. Why is she still- why is Shauna still here? Oh, Corona! I mean, the Mega Evolution successor is waiting for you up at the top of the tower. Thanks, Guru. Oh my God. Only those who improve may come. Oh, you're you may pass. Yeah, that's right. Realize who I am. I am all powerful. Not really. I barely. I shouldn't have won that match with the gym leader. 
But you know what? I went in the wrong floor. I'm sorry. Let's keep going. Dude. Ready for this? We get a mega Pokemon. And depending on what it is, I will 100% add it to my team. <clears throat> Come on, Corona. What's, what's up? Two Lucarios? I really love this place. When I'm here with my Pokemon looking at them. At the wide open sky above, all my worries disappear, and I feel like I can do anything! Thank you for coming all the way up here! It, it was decided that this must be the place where the Mega Ring is handed over! Something that may making sure we never forget it, to set our sights as high as the sky! And here it is, your very own Mega Ring! In the shape of a bracelet, so it's easy to wear! Why don't you just get a ring? You put a ring on your finger and you're like, Mega Ring, because that's what... Isn't that what Lysander has? By the way, we're barely in the hard part of the game. We're, we've only got three badges. Give your Pokemon the right Mega Stone to try battling with it. Your Pokemon will surely etch the call of Mega Ring. Hmm? Lucario, what's wrong? <laughs> Lucario, are you sure? You want to battle alongside that trainer? <laughs> I don't know what to say. I'm a bit shocked that some traveling creeper seems to have a stronger bond with you than I do. Oh, get roasted. I'm better than you in every way, Corona. Fight me. I'm so sorry. Ha! Huh. Well, we must be something special. So what do you say, trainer? Will you and Lucario battle against me in my Lucario? A Lucario on Lucario battle. It'll be a, nothing of short but riveting. Sure, let's do it. Perhaps it's just that, that it doesn't want to be close. To, want to lose the other Lucario, but it may be just, that it's just on the same wavelength as you. Let's do it. I'm down. Ready, Lucario? I love Lucario's got a pretty cool design. Let's give it all we got! I think, I don't know if we're gonna get Lucario thrown out, but we'll see what we throw out. Let's see. Okay, I have Lucario. Did it not randomize properly? Hey, I'll accept it, but they make you Mega Ball. I was like, an actual thing in this game. I'm kind of sad it didn't randomize properly. Maybe it's... Isn't, oh, doesn't next time I have a problem with randomizing Lucario? If not, I'll just do like a random Pokemon generator and I'll... Get like... I'll just put a Pokemon that ran, that could be mega into the game. Bop. Look at us go. Although we're doing the exact same thing. If that crits and kills me, I'll be mad. Are we speed tied? I wouldn't be surprised. Nope. We're faster. I think it's made. We have to win, basically. Normally you send out. I don't remember. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Thanks. When I suppose a battle, I could tell you that both. Tell that both Mega Lucario couldn't hold anything back. With strong balls of that, you wouldn't have. Any trouble training your Pokemon Spike Evolution? Groof. Okay, good. Let's see this. Yes. We'll send Leafy into the PC. I wonder if the poison barb I gave Leafy actually mattered. I received Lucario. Cool. Yes. Yeah, it's Lucario. Uh, I'm gonna name it... I'm gonna name it Mega, because what's gonna happen is I'm actually gonna... I'm actually gonna randomly generate a mega Pokemon because I'm not taking Lucario because it's a story and that is we we ignored the Snorlax so we're gonna ignore Lucario. So I will probably do a cut in like a few minutes after this is done, and we will go and swap out the Lucario for something actually usable. If I get Garchomp, by the way, we're using Garchomp not because I want to use another Garchomp. It's because it is a static. So we have to get whatever we get. It's almost, I'm gonna treat it like if Coronet gave us the Pokemon, because that's kind of the way it works. Now, I don't, okay. I'm gonna have to switch to my browser view camera. All right, so, knowing the ad on the screen, we've got a random number generator, and we've got a list of all the Mega Evolution Pokemon implemented in Pokemon X and Y. I will re-roll if we get Lucario. That is my rule. I will reroll if we get Lucario, or I'll actually just reduce the number to 25, and we'll just count past Lucario. So we're gonna do that. 
let's get generating number six. One, two, three, four, five. We got Kangaskhan. Bro, Mega Kangaskhan ain't bad. It's not a bad Pokemon. I will take it. I'm gonna look at the stuff on the game itself to figure out what its base ability was. I realized that Aerodactyl existed and that would have been, I don't use Aerodactyl ever. I've never gotten a chance, even Scissor. A bunch of these Pokemon are great. So what's gonna happen is in the next episode, I'm gonna gen in a Kangaskhan into our Pokemon game. I'm going to gen in Kangaskhan and we're gonna be able to use Kangaskhan in our Pokemon games, which is gonna be super dope. I'm gonna actually literally just replace Lucario with Kangaskhan, which is awesome. So in the next episode, we got that to look forward to. And actually, you know what? Let's extend this video a little bit. We got one more gift Pokemon to get. To get. And I would not be mad. Whoa. What just happened? The layout died. Where'd the layout go? Hold on. Is it looping? Um, it should be looping. No, that's not right. Where'd my layout go? I'm so confused. Do you guess? My layout just deleted itself. Shit, that means more editing in the future. I'll, I'll deal with it later. That's the fun behind the, the scenes of this series. I record with the layout on because it's an animated layout and it makes it easier to edit because I don't have to loop it and copy paste it. I will switch this out for my mega when we between episodes and I hate that I'm frustrated about that by the way I will fix it between episodes this guy here gives me a free Lapras don't battle me hold up already hold up already you what the hell you should use this thanks it's surf dope high quality I'm, I'm happy with that if you use it I'm surfing you travel over the water I think about it, it's kinda cool. How a person like you can come from the you know what I'm traveling with me? It's like dusty in a way. Excuse me, I'm better than you in every way, Serena. You're just being a bitch. This man gives me a Lapras. Yes, give me a name give me it. Yes, I would love to. Oh my god! It's a gibble! <laughs> I can't use it's, it's, it's a gibble! Oh my god, I name it. I'm naming it TS2.0. We're not gonna use it right now, but I have Garchomp Bite sitting in my bag. That's so funny. I didn't do anything. I swear on my life. I did absolutely nothing between episodes set up that make sure this was a gibble. I literally just was like, okay, we're gonna choose this Pokemon, whatever. I'm still holding an item. What items are holding? Weakness policy. Got rough skin now. This one has Dragon Claw, it's level 30, dude. This thing's actually not close to, pretty close to evolving Garchomp. I'm not using it, I will tell you that now. Because we have a full team, there's no reason to put a quad weakness to ice on our team. Anyways guys, now that we've done that, I'm gonna wrap it up here. If you guys have enjoyed, make sure you click the like button down below to support the channel and the series a lot. Don't be afraid to subscribe to the Crystal Crew now, so guys, I'll see you, you, and you in the next video. See you then, guys.